I came home from the Navy, the USN, in early 1975. I came home to 1034 Almeria, and I was a little aimless. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I, I had no work, and I needed to work. And uh, I told my father, you know, I, I'd like to be a fireman. And he made inquiries, because he knew lots of people, and he gently explained to me, he said, Reed, they're only hiring Cubans. This is Miami. And I was disappointed, but I said, okay, because you can't fight the city hall. <laughs> and I became a, a self-employed piano technician a couple of years later, but for two years I worked at Charlie's uh, Rinky Tink Amusement Company on pianos, restoring player pianos, and I, I taught myself how to tune and repair pianos, and soon I was working on the concert stage. But the point is, I wanted to be a fireman. Not a policeman, but a fireman. I wanted to save lives. But it wasn't going to work out that way because they weren't hiring gringo boys like me. And yet I was pretty competent and pretty intelligent. Yeah, so you can't fight City Hall. Now today I still admire fire rescue and police people. And most of them here in Miami are of Hispanic origin. There are relatively few uh, American-born, Anglo-Saxon, gringo types like me. But I love, I love Miami, and I love Cubans, and I love all the Hispanic people here. They've made our city a great place. And it began when I first met Cuban children in 1961 during the Pedro Pan operation. Our classroom was suddenly integrated. Fifteen out of the 30 children overnight were changed out, and Cuban children who didn't speak any English were in the place. But within two weeks or so, they were all chattering in English. <laughs> and we were just great friends, and I loved it. That was Miami in 1961, Operation Pedro Pan, and the plight of Pepito, the children displaced from a, from a ruined country, communist Cuba. They flourished here in Miami, and they made Miami a great city. So I want to say a few nice things about Miami and about the people who live here. I love it very much, and I don't want to move away.